What's going on guys? Today, I'm gonna to give you three tips for e-commerce entrepreneurs in 2020. This first one is for ladies and gentlemen who are looking to actually drop ship. First and foremost, the consistency of your movement in the business is what's going to determine your success, which means that you're just, not just gonna pick one product and find success, you have to go ahead and build up a whole fleet of properly researched items that you are prepared to go ahead and launch. This is how you find the success the quickest way. What I mean by this is the 2020 rule allows you to find 20 products straight, and then instead of testing them one by one, you'll go ahead and create landing pages, videos, targeting sheets, everything that you need to start marketing these items for all 20 items before you begin advertising. This will give you consistency and a workflow that you can continually work toward to actually find success in a much more consistent and fluent manner than doing things one at a time. My second tip is gonna make sure that whenever you're creating an e-commerce video, you're always conveying a proper marketing angle. A marketing angle is the ability for you to go ahead and convey a real message to the consumer, letting them know that there's a specific reason for them to buy this product. You always wanna hone in on a certain marketing angle. For example, let's say we have a plush actual dog bed. Instead of saying our dog bed's made of the finest plush materials and it comes in 10 different colors, you wanna focus on the specific marketing angle of, look, our plush dog bed allows your dog to actually sit on a more cozy and cushioned place at home, allowing them to constantly be under less stress and have less anxiety because of the special material that we use. Allowing you to go ahead and know you're making a smart buying decision and to also be very, very mindful and cautious of how you're treating your dog on a day-to-day -day basis. You got logic and emotion right there, which is phenomenal. So in all marketing angles, hit emotion and logic, which leads to, to my next point. Okay, the third point is going to be to make sure you're always hitting on emotion and logic, whether it be something that makes sense for someone, like if they have acne on their face, right? It'll be a logical decision to go ahead and buy some acne cream, right? But you also wanna make sure you're hitting the emotional spectrum of that actual angle as well. Instead of just saying it'll release your acne, it'll take your acne away, talk to them about how their life will be different. What are the benefits to having less acne? How will their outside life be different after their acne resides. Logical and emotional points are keys to a marketing angle, and that's very, very important for you guys to understand today. 